And go to Ginger. Hey, That's Ginger, every time morning. I see it. Good morning to you. Uh, let's talk about severe storms because the skies were opening up for so many. 229 reports in just the last 24 hours. Some of them tornadoes like this one, Jamestown, Tennessee. They'll get, out, they'll get out and do those surveys to see exactly what was going on there today. But we know there was huge hail, baseball size. That's Flower Mound, so north of Dallas, Fort Worth. And then the smaller hail still falling in Dallas itself. That same front is going to sink in. There's a dry hail. It goes all the way through the Gulf Coast and along the East Coast, too. Your local weather in just 30 seconds. Parts of Colorado had their wettest May in more than a decade and more of those slow moving storms. This is Kim, Colorado with that hail adding to the one, two inches of rain. Some places with those slow moving storms this morning could see an inch in just 30 minutes. So there are some warnings on the map, certainly some watches back to the Sierra too, and a quick look at how much will fall. Coming up here, Swifties helping Swifties, how some fans are helping others see the Eras tour without breaking the bank. Plus, three celebrity stylists are giving one deserving teacher the full glam treatment. And we're going to shop this store with gift ideas for dad or a new grad, all from Kohl's. Your local news and weather, next. Thanks, George. Looking at the tornadoes over the weekend. This one was from Saturday in Mississippi. They're still out there. Looking up here to New York City through New Jersey, eastern Pennsylvania. We're going to have damaging wind possibilities right on the edge of it. But south along the coast of North Carolina, you look for those as well. Look, it'll go all the way down to Wilmington. That's the big picture. Let's get a check now a little closer to home.